Hello. So at first, you need to download Unreal Engine and also Visual Studio Community, and then you can have some Net Core or some very good applications for you to develop. Download this one. And install them. After finished, you will see this installer. And I have already downloaded Visual Studio Community 2022. And also, I recommend you to download this Visual Studio Build Tools 2019. And make sure you need to, if you want to see your setup, you can come to modify. Normally, you need to embo gaming and with C++. Also, you need to check out your SDK and I am this one as well. And also individual component. In my case, I need to download this one and another one is less free. I recommend if you run into issue, you need to find netcore 3.1 and also, also I recommend you to install net framework. 461 SDK and framework C 6.6 4.6. So let's all oh, when you finish downloading downloading them, you can go to Unreal Engine, log in your account and download Unreal Engine. Just download the launcher. Yes. And when you finish, you can open the launcher. Go to Unreal Engine here. Find library. It will ask you to download the latest version 5. Download this one. And if you want to have the older version, just click here and download. Press install. They are quite big, so it takes some time. Are my projects. So when you finish downloading, you can launch Unreal Engine and let it, let it run. Now I choose game and you can choose blank one in my case. And it depends on you. You can choose blueprints or C++ or do you want the starter content? It's up to you. And normally I just leave it by default. Choose a location for you to store the games. And this one, I will just call test to test that. I should, shouldn't use dash. I should use underscore. Dash is in the middle. Underscore is on the ground. Yeah, right. Create. Now we are creating a new project. So launching Unreal Engine. Open it. Create a new game. I choose blank one. And it's up to you. You are a developer. You can use C++. These two, I will leave it by default. It's up to you if you want a starter content. And this one is up to you. Test. And you can choose the location by pressing this icon to store your projects. Now press create. So the first time when you open Unreal Engine, it looks like this. But because I have already set it up to Visual Studio Code, so it ha it opens Visual Studio Code for me. But normally, by default, it should be Visual Studio. So now let me tell you how to set up for VS Code. At first, go to Edit, Editor Preferences, and find Source Code. Choose Visual Studio Code. And when you press Visual Studio Code, the Unreal Engine will ask you to restart. Just restart. So when you come back, you will go to VS Code. And if I open the C++ here, you will see now everything works fine. But there are some common issues, for example, if I create a new C++ class, maybe a maybe an actor, just an actor. Yeah, and sometimes you will run into issue. Yeah, like this, you couldn't find the header. So what should we do? In my case, I will close close them all and go to the folder of the game. Come to the folder and uh, delete this one. Delete save. Delete 
binaries. And now rebuild. Show more options. Generate. So this option will help you to regenerating those folders. And now click twice. Yes. So, so if you come to VS Code, so now click the actor or anything else in C++ classes, it will open open in VS Code and now everything is fine see so yeah that's all I've done I hope you find it helpful